All right, we got our Bighorn 200 GVX here. It's a little bit of a crappy rainy day here in North Carolina. This is a brand new machine. I want to show you around it. Still got the plastic on the bumper. We got these in a few different colors. You got drink holders on each side. You got a hood there. The battery's under the hood. <clears throat> Some other electrical components. You got a winch mount plate there for a winch. You got full wheel disc brakes on this. You got a strut type suspension in the front. It's the oil cooler there. It's a very rugged machine. Um, you've also got rack and pinion steering. You ain't gonna believe how easy this thing steers. This is the gas one. You got a lot of ground clearance too. It'll run about 26 mile an hour, 27 mile an hour for a couple people on it. You got an option to put a windshield and mirrors and turn signals in the front. It already has the turn signals in the back. You got seat belts in the front. You got a lot of room in the cab of this thing. You got a little bit of a glove compartment there. There's an accessory plug there to plug accessories in. And then over here, you got your switches. You turn your uh, lights on right here and off. High beam, low beam, left and right turn signals. You got a horn here. And then you got the override button for the reverse that gives it full power in reverse. And then you got your digital dash. It tells you how many miles is on the machine. Your battery indicator, uh, your fuel gauge right there. It tells you how much fuel's in it. And then you got a tachometer. That right there is the park brake light. Park brake's on. Then you got a neutral light. You just shift this in the forward or shift it in reverse and mash the gas and go. That's all they are to it. It's pretty simple. And then here in the back, you got your handle here to hold on or help you get onto the cart and then this seat here is uh, foldable it actually folds down and it makes a little bit of a bed and fold it up for the rear seats it's your rear tail lights and your turn signals they come on the machine that's the transmission it's a locking unlocking system and what it does is it locks solid in the two-wheel drive whenever you're going you got an axle drive with heavy duty axles in this machine. Dual A arms on both sides, and you got the disc brakes in the back. And you got adjustable coilover shocks on the back of the machine, too. You can either tighten them up or loosen them up, stiffen them up if you're hauling a lot of people or something like that. Just wanted to show you how thick the axle was on that thing. It's a direct drive, too. It's a real quiet machine. This is where you put the gas in it. Let's take the gas cap off. Fill it gas, holds about five gallons. Then the seat pops up. And that's where the engine is on this machine. That's the fuel tank. You're gonna be surprised it barely burns any fuel at all. Then you got a large storage compartment over there. A lot of people turn that into a cooler or something. But to crank and run the machine, all you do is just mash the brake. It's got an electric truck on it. It's really cold here in North Carolina today. But as you can see, it's real quiet. This is your park brake over here on this side. You just pull down on it, mash the button, release the park brake. You're ready to go. Just shift it into gear. When you go in the Ford, the neutral light comes off. Make sure you come to a complete stop whenever you get ready to change gears. Then you pull it into neutral, neutral light comes on, shift it in reverse, and there you have reverse. And it's also got a reverse buzzer. That's pretty much it. You got a real rugged top that this thing comes with too. I pull these things up down the road all the time. and Definitely when it's cold outside, you're going to definitely want a windshield on this thing. And we also have uh, full enclosures that zip up. So thanks for taking the time to watch our video, and uh, if you're looking for the ultimate gas golf cart, this is definitely going to be the machine for you. There's nothing in this market, in the golf cart market, that even comes close to comparing to this machine, or the quality of the people at uh, Lenhai Yamaha, is the people that actually build this machine, folks from there put a lot of time and research and development into this thing 
And it's something if you take care of, it's going to last you for a lot of years to come. Thank you for taking time to watch this, and I look forward to any questions that you have.